Hi guys, Dane here, and welcome to another weekly reading vlog. I'm currently reading Sad Cypress by Agatha Christie. I've made a pretty good dent in it, so I'm hoping to finish either tonight or tomorrow. We will see. Uh, I have about like 70, 80 pages left to go. And then I haven't decided what I'm going to read next, but um, I'm quite... Well, I've redone, I've resorted my um, TBR shelves, which is what I'm currently looking at now, but it kind of gives me a much clearer view of what I've got, and it's all alphabetical by author surname. So I can just pick something out, maybe some Asimov, because I do have like I've got like half a shelf of Asimov to get through, uh, but I've got some, like I've got the early Asimov, so I might I might read that. Um, but yeah, we will see. And it's Sunday. I don't know if I said that. And I'm watching the chase on YouTube. Hello, it is me. It is uh, November the well, it's what is it? Is it Monday? It's Monday, November the 9th. Um, you might have noticed I'm growing my beard. Susie and I for our YouTube channel linked below. Uh, Madam Lord Literature and Madam Media. Every time I was saying this to, to Susie, every time I think of it, I always think Madam Media and Lord Literature. So I don't know whether we should change the name. We've got it Lord Literature and Madam Media because it's alphabetical. But it also unintentionally um, you know, amplifies the old um the stereotype of the the male name coming first and whatnot. And uh don't want to be misconstrued. Plus Lord Literature and Oh no, I got it right this time. But when I was trying to think of the other one, I can never get it right. Anyway, um, we're going to do a video on stoicism, so I need to grow my beard so I can look like a philosopher. Uh, it, so as I say, it's Monday night. Uh, Susie came over yesterday and um, we played some, some of this Jack the Ripper item fighting game. Then she headed home. I've been finishing off a few tasks, uh, like to spring clean my house, basically. So I've sorted out through my wardrobe now. Um, today I moved the bed out and, and hoovered underneath the bed. So I need to do the same with the sofa and where all my computers are. And it's going to be a ball ache. And the other thing I need to do is I need to roughly alphabetize my eBay stock, which is also going to be a ball ache. But those are the two. Oh, and I've got to clean out the hoover, which is also going to be a ball ache. Um, but once I've got those done, I've done everything else. And I've done some of the other ball achy jobs, like cleaning beneath the sink and stuff. Um, and Susie gave me a real real hand cleaning everything up as well. So it's actually almost habitable in here now. Uh, so she's back at hers. She's going to stay at hers for the next few days. Uh, we're in lockdown in the UK, so I can't go anywhere anyway. So I'm just going to be working and being productive. I've got a ton of work stuff to do. I've got a ton of my own writing stuff to do. And I have a ton of um, video stuff to do as well. Now I've got the camera back. So I should be cracking on with that. I finished reading Sad Cyprus by Agatha Christie yesterday. That was a four out of five, I think. It was pretty good. And now I'm reading the early Asimov volume one. Um, and I'm kind of burning through it pretty quickly. There are three volumes of this. So I'm probably going to do Asimov. I might even do Asimov Christie, Asimov Christie, Asimov Christie. We'll see. I might intersperse it with something else. Uh, yeah, we'll see what I feel like. I've got to go and have a look at my, my bookcase later. So that is where we are at. Uh, all right, it is quarter past seven in the morning. Uh, I've just made myself a coffee. I haven't been to bed yet, so we're just going to try to stay up now. I'm showing you this dark screen because this is what I have to move. I've got to try and move all of this out and hoover beneath it. That's my next job. I kind of cleaned out the inside of Henry Hoover. Kind of. He's not doing very well in there, to be honest. But that's my last job, is to pull all, pull the sofa out. Hang on. Yeah, my last job is to pull the sofa and those units out there, empty out all of the stuff that's in them to be sorted through, uh, hoover behind where they are now, and then put them back, and uh, yeah, then just sort through all the crap that's behind it. I'm just going to drag it all out for now, and then just hoover the house. And then that's all of my housework theoretically done. I've got some clothes, some laundry currently drying, so it'd be nice to put that away. But I, I can wait until last to do that, you know? So my plan is to just keep on being productive now until I've finished all of the jobs. Because then I can relax. And then it'll just be nice in here when Susie comes to visit, so that's good. And Biggie will enjoy it more. Although he did just do a horrible smelling poo and is now in the window somewhere. Uh, Bookwise, I'm still reading the early Asimov volume one, but I'm pretty close to the end now So I probably will finish this in a couple of hours I think and then I haven't decided what to read next. We'll see Oh, yeah, and I'm probably gonna get a copyright strike because I didn't even realize that the Foo Fighters was playing in the background there So that's where we're at um, Yeah, I'm um, also like while I've been up during the night. I've done some working as well. So that's good. I'm 
in a pretty good place with most things. I don't think I have anybody... Right, so I feel like I don't have anybody who's going to be chasing me for anything for the, over the next 24 hours. So, and, and I'm pretty close to being done on a bunch of my stuff. So normally, I'm like missing out on doing stuff because of deadlines galore and stuff. So it's just nice there's a little bit less pressure on me at the moment. Hello, oh, I'm done. I've finished um, pulling out the sofa and uh, hoovering all behind that. I've finished all of my housework now. Um, yeah, there's nothing else on my list. Um, so the only thing I really have to do now, I'm gonna take a shower in a bit and then I'm gonna, um, I've got some eBay parcels to wrap. Uh, I did my walk earlier, went into town, went to the banks to do some stuff there. So that was good, got that ticked off. So um, yeah, just catching up with stuff still. Trying to crack on for as long as I can before I go to sleep. I finished reading The Early Asimov Volume 1 and now I am reading Taken at the Flood by Agatha Christie. And I got myself some donuts from Greg's. They make vegan ring donuts and they're delicious. Uh, uh, yep. Yo! Oh my lord, I am tired. It's 10 to 7 in the evening so I have managed to stay up all day. I got everything done, I've cleaned up behind the sofa now, so that's good, and I've also hoovered the house and done everything else. I still have a few uh, few more bits that I'm waiting for to be delivered, um, and I've got some clothes that are drying that will then need putting away, but I can't do that right now. I have a few parcels down here that need to be wrapped as well um, for eBay, but that's no like desperate rush or anything, so I can just crap, uh, crack on with those as and when. Uh, so yeah, now I'm going to go and do my shower, and then that's me done. Oh, and then maybe I'll switch to doing some writing and editing. I've been working on Scarlet Sins, which is my collection of short stories and songs, um, which will possibly be my next release. So I've had my first round of edits on that back from Pam. Uh, so working on that, yeah. And just other stuff, art and stuff. Got a t-shirt campaign running, so I've ordered six t-shirts, and I'm very excited. So tired. Oh, I'm gonna sleep well tonight, I hope. Yeah, hello, guten Abend. Ich bin dein. It's Wednesday, I don't know how to say Wednesday. Uh, is it Wednesday? Yes, it is Wednesday, it's about half five. So I've just about finished my work for the day. I'm currently watching 42 on YouTube, talking about why light bulbs are designed to break. I'm still reading Taken at the Flood by Agatha Christie. I'm not gonna lie, it's not very good. Um, I'm just, just over halfway through with this bad boy. Uh, and then I don't know what I'm going to read. I was going to go with Asimov uh, Early Fiction Volume 2, but I don't know. I need a different kind of book, I think, because I've been reading a lot of these ones that are short, but have like small print. So I think I might even go with um, Got to Get Through This by Louis Theroux next, we'll see. Or Sapkowski, I've got the next Witcher book over there. Yeah, uh, I've got a Christmas tree that came today. My guitars used to be up there, but I did that. I've finished all my housework now including pulling out um, the sofa and hoovering behind all that uh, and actually made myself some more space in here which is good so uh, house is pretty much tidy for when Susie comes over I might have one quick go round with a hoover before she gets here just to make it really nice for her you know uh, and I think I'm gonna be cooking dinner I'm gonna be making um, jalapeno ve vegan jalapeno mac and cheese which would be really nice don't know if she's staying over yet, she's welcome to if she would like to. We'll probably play some more of the Jack the Ripper PC game. I've got these little baubles for us as well, you know, like that you put on a Christmas tree. I've got these little plastic ones that you can... Basically, we've got, you've got them here and we can either, like, just attach them together and they're, they're transparent. So we could have some transparent ones um, and put, like, little things in them. So, I don't know, a plectrum or something, whatever. Any, like... Lego figures would go in them and stuff, but we can also paint them, which is probably what we're going to do. But having them transparent, we can even do both, and we could make like a little, put some glitter in and make a little snow globe style stuff. So I'm quite excited. The possibilities are endless. So probably, I guess this weekend, maybe on Saturday, we'll go into town uh, to go to like one of the pound shops to get a bunch of Christmas decorations and supplies to do the baubles and do the tree and stuff. Because then we can use it for videos for Lord Literature and Madam Media, our YouTube channel, which is linked below, which you should check out. So we can get to 100 subscribers, so we can get a custom URL. 
that's all I've got for you really. I'm also working on some books and stuff, working on some art centre stuff. I've got an interview scheduled at 7pm with a guy called Graham, a poet. Now I've updated you in here, I don't have a huge amount to do. I've got a couple of tabs in this that I'm currently using with Rizzler, which I can film for the review. Uh, and then yeah, I've got video editing to do and the next radio show to record, which is very exciting. Oh, you're not going to believe this, I've been so productive with like filming -y stuff. So I've caught up with all of the reviews that I had to film because uh, I lent Susie my camera while she was away. So uh, I've caught up all, with all, all of the reviews of all the books that I read while she was gone. And I've also caught up with my radio shows. I did an interview tonight for next week's show. All of next week's show is recorded and I've recorded all of my bits for the show after. Which I'm going to do as a, um, basically I have some like... Uh, highlights that I've collected and so I can create it as a highlight show I don't have anything specific in it that actually dates it and then I can keep that as a finished show that's ready I can maybe even keep it in my in my Wickham sound box as for emergencies if I don't get the show the next week's show done in time you know so um, yeah that's kind of the plan we'll see how that goes it does mean I need to get my friend Dave who does Album reviews for me. I need to get him to do another one on top of the one he's already doing, but he'll like that. Uh, and also, I'm near the end of Taken at the Flood. I think I have about 15 20 pages to go. I still haven't decided what book's going to be next, so I need to do that soon. But um kind of looking forward to getting to the next book, to be honest. It's not been it's not been Agatha Christie's best, but hey ho, I've been reading it anyway. So that's where we're at. I'm a bit worried about going to sleep because I've had really bad anxiety in bed the last couple nights. So I'm not too sure what to do about that. Um, we will see. But tomorrow night Susie's coming over and so I will at least get cuddles. So maybe I won't have panic attacks. I have just got back from being down the art centre. Susie stayed over yesterday so I made jalapeno mac and cheese. Um, so we're both on the leftovers for that today. And we watched This Is Spinal Tap, which was very nice. Uh, she stayed at mine and headed off to work today, and then she's coming back over after work. I've got an interview to, to do later with a band called Fabless Parfait uh, for my radio show, so I will do that in a shortly. Well, in a shortly, in like eight hours, so that's all right. Uh, as I say, I've been down to the art centre. Somebody had to pick up some paintings, so I sorted that. Um, got a bit of tidying to do, mostly washing up bits, um, and I want to do the hoovering again before Suva com Susie comes back. Suva. Uh, because I couldn't figure out how to use my hoover because it's ridiculous and it didn't come with any manuals. But um, yeah, I've now learned how it works because Susie helped. So I, that means I can hoover before she comes over because I didn't really get to do it properly. Uh, I'm currently still reading Time Out of Joint by Philip K. Dick. It's, it's alright, you know. Alright guys, uh, I finished reading me dick, I finished dick, so time out of joint, ticked off 3.5 out of 5 and I'm now just starting The Big Four by Agatha Christie, uh, which I will update you in in next week's vlog because this seems like a good time to end it, so as always, thanks a lot for watching, don't forget to hit that like button if you've enjoyed this video, let me know in the comments if you've read any of these books and if so what you thought of them, hit that subscribe button for more and I will see you soon for another bookish video, thanks a lot, bye bye.